Dinosaur Footprints in Texas Revealed When Rivers Dry NationalGeographic.co.id Dinosaur footprints from about 113 million years ago have been revealed at Dinosaur Valley State Park in Texas. The footprints appeared after the severe drought conditions that drained the river that flows there. Stephanie Salinas Garcia of the Texas Department of Parks and Wildlife said the dry weather made the trail visible. Due to the extreme dry conditions last summer, the river was completely dry in most locations, allowing more tracks to be found in the park, he said. Under normal river conditions, these new, dinosaur, tracks are underwater and are usually filled with sediment, leaving them buried and invisible. He explained that most of the recently revealed tracks found in various parts of the river in the park belong to Acrocanthosaurus. This is a dinosaur that would have stood, as an adult, about 15 feet or 4.5 meters high and, weighing, almost 7 tons, he said. As is well known, Acrocanthosaurus is a genus of dinosaur from the Carcharodontosauridae family that lived at the beginning of the Cretaceous or Cretaceous period in North America. Fossils have previously been found in Texas, Oklahoma, and possibly in Maryland because fossilized teeth were found to belong to Acrocanthosaurus. Another species that has left its mark in the park in Glen Rose, Texas, is Sauroposidon, which stands about 60 feet tall and weighs about 44 tons as an adult, Garcia added. Sauroposidon is a genus of sauropod dinosaur that is known from several incomplete specimens including fossils and traces that have been found in the states of Oklahoma, Wyoming, and Texas in the United States. This summer's excessive drought has left a river in the park completely dry in most places. As a result, the dry river has revealed its tracks, the last secret that has been hidden for a long time recently. More than 60% of Texas experienced drought last week in the two most intense categories. The state also recently experienced a heatwave that pushed temperatures into the triple digits, putting millions of people under an excessive heat warning. The human-caused climate crisis has also increased the potential for dramatic change that occurs more frequently in periods of drought and high rainfall, such as this week's flash floods in the Dallas area. Under normal weather conditions, dinosaur tracks found at the bottom of the river are underwater and filled with sediment, which makes them less visible, Garcia explained. Being able to find these finds and experience new dinosaur tracks is always a great time at the park. Meanwhile, the trail is expected to be buried again because rain is forecast, said Garcia, who added the process helps protect the track from natural weathering and erosion. While these newer dinosaur tracks were visible for a short period of time, it brings wonder and excitement about discovering new dinosaur tracks in the park, Garcia said. Dinosaur Valley State Park will continue to protect this 113 million year old trail not only for current generations but also for future generations. The only traces are the most recent discoveries made by lowering of water levels due to drought, both in the United States and in other countries. Several sets of human remains have been found at Lake Mead in Utah in recent months as the reservoir has fallen to about 27% of its total capacity. In eastern Serbia in Europe, Dozens of German warships still laden with explosives were spotted on the drying Danube River. Later, a prehistoric stone circle dubbed the Spanish Stonehenge was revealed in the diminishing Valdecanas Reservoir in rural Spain. And a Buddha statue believed to be 600 years old was found in the receding Yangtze River. That was Dinosaur Footprints in Texas revealed when the river dried. Thank you for watching this video, don't forget to like and subscribe so you get other interesting videos.